M0FXB. I'm just going to quickly show you this SWR analyzer or meter that we've got on the Zygu G90. So all you do is hold down the power button. It does go into TX and look, I've got a 40 meter antenna, which is a 91 ball and 20 meter wire. And it does very well, doesn't it? That's on 40. Now let's just come off there by hitting the quit button here. Now we'll go up to 80 or down to 80. It's very, I mean, it's not a good antenna for 80. It's, it's half the length it needs to be, as you can see. So let's do the, uh, let's tune it now first. Actually, this, we won't tune it yet. We'll do the analyzer first. So look, it's showing a very high SWR there. It does get better. Okay, so let's quit that. Let's ch now tune it and see the difference. Anyway, it struggles to tune, but it did do it. So now let's hold down power. Same result, really, but it's the wrong antenna. But there you are, I thought I'd show you it in action. SWR meter. And then you hit the quick button. Try 20. Tune it first. Yes, yeah, tune's better. And then hold down power. There you go. It's funny how it it is good for a while and then it jumps off. That it, well, it's just shown that it's not good. So there you are. Thought I'd show you that. Bye for now. Seven three. All the best. Hit the quit button. Back to normal. But it, it, yeah, I think it's a very good radio myself for the um, for what they cost and for what they do. Let me just here. So I had a lot of people say to me, this or the X6100. And I, I would say that it's a different experience. The screen, although it's a lot smaller the interaction with the screen info is virtually the same as the zygo if you ask me they both got cwd code a antenna tuners but the thing you get with this unit is that it's 20 watts that is, makes quite a difference that it's 20 watts also it's a you know it's it's a, it's i wouldn't say it's a lot bigger but it's definitely a bigger unit Quite easy to carry around. It is a bit. It is a one-handed unit. Look, there's my hand on it. Not hard to chuck in the car, caravan, etc. But there's no battery, so you do have to have a power supply. And the screen is quarter the size of the X6100. Price-wise, £400 in the UK, which I think is actually you get a lot for your money on that. Myself. Um, where the X6100 is £600. So if you want a mobile radio and that 20 watts makes a lot of difference, the Zygu, if you, if you don't power it, you are pretty much stuck with five, five watts, which is okay, but you do, you know, obviously you struggle with 20 watts. Nearly every time I call out, I get a reply. So to me, I like them both, get them both, but... Um, I'm quite, um, actually quite impressed with the G90. Bye for now, 7-3.